Yo, 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 what is going on, everyone? Thanks so much for tuning in today. My name is Tesseline, and in this video, we are continuing with the conservation restaurant. And in this episode, we're going to be making the elevator, which lets the guest figuratively go from the first floor to the, uh, the second one. And of course, game mechanic wise, this elevator will not be used whatsoever. It's just more a decorational aspect to uh, yeah, finish the overall look a little bit better and to make it a bit more realistic. Like bits here and there, realistically speaking, will most likely not really work the way that they should. But uh, yeah, like we try to get sort of close to a realistic look and feel. Measurement wise, we are really trying to yeah like get the right measurements going. So we do use a couple of the staff members to yeah like stand in place where they need to be, and from that aspect, we are yeah, like going to make the uh, the cabin itself. It's like the the thingy that goes up and down that moves the guest from the first floor to the second one. And in terms of looks of the elevator itself, we are. Taking inspiration from the Bradbury building elevator. And the Bradbury elevator is a building, a landmark, so to speak, uh, which is situated in Los Angeles, California. And it has like a industrial older look to it. Uh, we'll be able to like get a photo going right now. So you'll be able to see the, uh, yeah, like the inspiration and like what we use for it. It's not necessarily in mind and like in aspect of like what we've been doing so far because it's like more modern and like industrial kind of look for the restaurant building itself so like for the foundation so at first this elevator may not really stand like sort of together with everything uh, but whenever it's all finished it really does look very good in my opinion and uh, like for some reason it does really work together and i think that's also because we used building materials that we already used in the building and because we are using things together it sort of creates that like cohesive feeling to it and even though yeah like again the uh, the overall inspiration from this elevator is not really working out with the restaurant itself it really does work so it's um it's very nice whatever it's like finished and also in place like i said at the beginning of the video mechanic wise guests will not be able to use this elevator so it's only decorational and we do place like uh, tables and like everything going for the uh, the restaurant itself. So we will be able to link those tables to the restaurant or with the restaurant, I should say. And yeah, like that will create that feel again that guests are actually like able to uh, use this elevator, even though unfortunately mechanic wise, that's not the case. So the, uh, the tables will be used and filled on the first floor. And also the tables that we're going to be placing on the ground level, they'll all be yeah, like connected and used. And this will be for decorational purposes. Overall though, these builds that you see in YouTube videos have been created live over on Twitch, where we are actually well underway in the real time aspect of the, uh, the build overall. And we've made some very good progress so far. And uh, yeah, if you are interested, in seeing all these builds live then feel free to click the link in the description down below i will get the link going down there if you've never seen a live stream before on twitch we get all these like builds live going and if you for example yeah interested in knowing how these builds are created in the first place and how we sort of like go from step to step and from a like point a to point b then uh, yeah, feel free to hop on over in one of the live streams over on Twitch. And if you have like any questions, for example, then we'll uh, answer those questions live on Twitch. So uh, yeah, feel free to uh, check out one of those future live streams on Twitch if you haven't already. So if we look in the near future in terms of builds, etc. We still have like a couple of videos going for the restaurant because there's still quite some bits that I would like to show in a video, uh, which yeah, like gets us to the, uh, the finish of the build itself. And after the restaurant, we are tackling a previous building uh, that you are able to see like here and there in the background whenever we are working on this elevator. And it's the entrance building that we created some time ago. It's actually from August last year. And we, yeah, like we started on the, uh, the foundations of the building back then. So it's more the, the outside of the building and like the, the rough foundations on it. 
And yeah, IRL, at this very moment, we are yeah, like already underway in fine tuning uh, that build and making some changes here and there and also decorating the inside already. So there's also like another reason if you uh, yeah like want to have like a little head on start on things. And uh, yeah, those will be uh, just shown on the Twitch as well, of course, in those live streams. Video wise though, on YouTube, it will take a little bit of time before we get there, because again, some other videos will be shown first for the restaurant build. So for now, I want to thank you all very much for tuning in today. It's very much appreciated for tuning in. Thank you, thank you. Hopefully you will enjoy the remaining up to speed builds. Again, all the links for also videos related on the entrance building, for example, I will link in the description down below and also for the Twitch live streams. So hopefully I will see you all in a future live stream or otherwise in a future video over here on YouTube. Once again, thank you so much. I will see you later. Stay safe. Have a good one. Bye-bye.
Let's go, 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 let's go